What's going on, everybody? This is the Dog and Yard bringing you episode 51, 52, a special live edition of Let's Fail at Half Life 2. Oh, it's Judith Mossman. I'll take him from here. Don't struggle, it's no use. Until you're where he wants you, there's nothing you can do. Yeah, you'd know all about that, you traitor. I'm sorry, Gordon. Right. Sounds unhygienic. Inhabited by vast meteorological intelligences. Worlds stretched thin across the membranes where the dimensions intersect. intersect. Impossible to describe with our limited vocabulary. What I've seen is also beyond words, Breen. Genocide. Indescribable evil. Good God. Hi. Well, if it isn't Gordon Freeman at last. Glad to join you, asshat. What's this? I'll put it over there. What's that? My invisible gravity You gun. have my gratitude, Doctor. First you lead me straight to the doorstep of my oldest friend. Mm -hmm. and then you deliver yourself. If I'd known you were going to come straight up to my office, I wouldn't have bothered hunting you in the first place. I think you would have enjoyed doing it. Anyway. Having both of you in my keeping ensures I can dictate the terms of any bargain I care to make with a Combine. Also, oh, a world <laughs> isn't enough, then. <laughs> Dr. Breen. Huh? Wallace. Yes, Judith, what is it? The bargain we should be making is for Eli's life so he can continue his research. Thanks to you, we have everything we need in that regard. You're more than qualified to finish his research yourself. What so neither you him. nor I can do is convince that rabble in the streets to give up their senseless struggle. Yet Eli refuses to speak the words that would save them all. Save them? For what? Eli, if you won't do the right thing for the good of all people, maybe you'll do it for one of them. Alex. Well, honey. Dad. Here we all are. Gordon? I. God damn yeah. you, bring you let her go. That's yeah, all up to you, my old friend. Will you let your stubborn short-sightedness doom the entire species, or will you give your child the chance your mother never had? <laughs> How dare you even mention her! Right, Breen. Alex, my dear, you have your mother's eyes, but your father's stubborn nature. You haven't seen a bit of it yet. Tell him. Really? Well, let's see how well it serves you on the far side of a combined portal. Go ahead, Breen. <laughs> if that's the worst you can do, send us both through your portal. Oh, it's hardly the worst. But you might find that hard to believe once you get there. It isn't necessary. I agree. It's a total waste. Fortunately, the Resistance has shown it is willing to accept a new leader. And this one has proven to be a fine pawn for those who control him. No! Don't listen to him, Gordon. How Don't about it, worry. Doug Freeman? No. Did you realize your contract was open to the highest bidder? Okay, Gordon maybe, would yeah. never make any kind of deal with you. I understand if you don't wish to discuss this in front of your friends. I'll send them on their way and then we can talk over it at all. Actually. Don't struggle, honey. Dad, I'm so sorry. Alex, shoot up. Judith? All right. What do you think you're doing? Yeah, We're doing Judith. what I could never do alone. We're stopping you. Badass. Yes. Guards, get in here. Oh, no. They know you betrayed them. They'll oh, turn on you. Crap. Judith, they're, they're Dr. Mossman, here. please. I'm sorry, Wallace. You're all out of time. Yeah. You tell them, Judith. Don't. Oh. Hurry. Visible gravity gun. Shit's Dad, going down. Hang on. Uh, guys. You fool! Uh, uh, Watch out, out, he's gonna no. oh, no, no. Oh, damn it. Dad. damn it. Oh no, no, no. Don't worry about me, honey. There's no time, Alex. He's on his way to the portal. You'll need this. Ooh, a taser. Always use Dr. Taser. Mossman. Judith. Look after my father. That's a weird Don't you expression. worry. Aw, sentimental Dad, moment. I'm not saying goodbye. Never. Come on, Gordon. Let's go. Right. Gordon, we haven't known each other very long, but 
I know you didn't have to do this. I had to rescue my father, but you... Well... Thanks for coming after me. No problem. It's me you should be hey, listen! Shut up. That's him! Yes, I know. Now shut up. The destination is untenable. Surely you can set the relay elsewhere. There's no way I can survive in that environment. The host body must be choking. I can't possibly... There he is! Oh, yes. All right, damn it. That's what it takes. Just hurry. He's right behind me. Hi. Oh, shit. Hi. Damn it. Damn it! Not again! Shoot. Hey! Look what he left behind. Oh yeah. The gravity gun. Rearmed. <laughs> he doesn't have a clue, does he? Nope. Not one. I wonder where he's going. To hell? The elevator was going down. Hopefully to hell. Oh my god. This is the Citadel's dark fusion reactor. It powers their tunneling entanglement device. That sounds bad. We'll never have a chance like this again. We've got to stop Dr. Breen. Sounds good. Stopping Dr. Breen is always one of my favorite things. I can't shut it down. Looks like he's turned over control to the other side. Shoot. You'll have to go into the core and do what you can. Okay, I'll do my best. Get in the elevator and I'll let you in. Okay. Don't forget to charge up your suit. Yeah, it's already charged. We good? Do good. your worst, Gordon. But be careful. Yeah. Ooh, intense music. You know it's gonna be bad when there's intense music and I can't speak over it. Okay, where are we going? Hi, Dr. Dr. Freeman, you really shouldn't be out there. At the moment of synapse, as I teleport, this chamber will be bathed in deadly particles that have yet to be named by human science. Perhaps when I have the leisure to do the work myself, I'll name one of them after you. That way you won't be completely forgotten. When the singularity collapses, I will be far away from here, in another universe as a matter of fact. You, on the other hand, will be destroyed in every way it is possible to be destroyed, and even in some which are essentially impossible. That's pretty thorough. Pretty thorough destruction. Oh no, Combine soldiers! Where do they come from? Trying to say, um, I 
tried this before, but Fraps wasn't Keep shut going. up. Keep going. Shut up. Fraps I could have told you that was pointless. Both of you stop Go talking. Forward. Are you still with us, Dr. Freeman? Yes. Not for much longer, I think. If only you had harnessed your boundless energy for a useful purpose. Okay, I'm oh my god. Whoa. The portal's opening. Oh. Okay. I hope you said your farewells. Go back, Freeman! You have no idea what you're doing! Is it really that time again? I guess so. It seems as if you only just arrived. Hello, Mr. G-Man. You've done a great deal in a small time span. You've done so well, in fact, that I've received some interesting offers for your services. Ordinarily, I wouldn't contemplate them, but these are extraordinary times. Rather than offer you the illusion of free choice, I, like I will illusion. take the liberty of Damn choosing it. for you. If and when your time comes round again. I like my free choice. I do apologize for what must seem to you an arbitrary imposition, Dr. Freeman. An arbitrary imposition. I trust it will all make sense to you in the course of... Well... I'm really not at liberty to say. At liberty? Or do you just not want to? In the meantime, bastard. this is where I get off. And what about me? No, don't, don't walk away while I'm speaking to you, damn it. Aw, oh, hell. Well, 